New York's mayor is also applauding a decision by the district attorney to drop a murder charge against a convenience store clerk, calling it an example of how innocent New Yorkers should be able to work in peace. That employee claimed self-defense when a man stabbed uh, when he stabbed a man to death during a fight caught on camera. Now, Nick Smith is here with a new reaction to a decision that has been weeks in the making. A lot of happy people. A lot of happy Nick. people, Mitch. The Manhattan District Attorney's Office concluded a homicide case could not be proven beyond a reasonable doubt, saying Jose Alba's actions were reasonable because he believed Austin Simon went behind the counter with the intention of committing a crime. The charge against Jose Alba sparked a nationwide conversation about self-defense and the right to safety. New York City leaders, business owners, community members, all coming together to clear him of murder. This outcome that was what we were looking for, and we, really, and we got it, so I'm happy. But my main thing is, let's bring public safety back to New York. New York City Mayor Eric Adams agrees with the decision to drop the charge. I support hardworking, innocent people that are doing their job. And I saw him as a hardworking, innocent New Yorker that a person went behind the counter and attacked him. A key factor, the video evidence. The encounter caught on a surveillance camera shows a fight over a bag of chips. When the payment was declined, Alba took back the chips, leading Simon to demand an apology, pushing Alba when he didn't get one. A defense attorney tells News Nation's Marnie Hughes the DA did the right thing. I think they got this one right. They went back. They reviewed it all. They looked at the clerk statement, the witness statements, and that all important video. And I think they thought to themselves, we cannot prove beyond a reasonable doubt that Alba was not acting in self defense. Austin Simon's family says they're heartbroken, but understand the decision. My cousin should not have gone behind that counter. But at the end of the day, three people are wrong, but only one person is dead. And I'm I'm really disappointed in the disregard for human life. Well, the DA's office has also decided not to pursue charges against Simon's girlfriend who stabbed Alba after he stabbed Simon. This is a situation where so many people were watching closely just to see how it would play out. Because the video plays out. Video. And it's and it, it appears to be extremely clear. In fact, Adrian, everyone involved said that were it not for that video evidence, things may have gone differently. Absolutely. Okay. Well, thank you, Nick. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.